All right, today I'm gonna talk about busing tables, being a busser, um, and one of the reasons that I wanna cover this is because a lot of people, when they first start in the restaurant industry, they don't have enough experience to end up being a waiter right off the bat, or a waitress, and uh, it's easy to get a waiting position once you show the other staff members that you, you know, give a shit about the guests, that you're a team player, that you like to um, make good money and like to work hard. And the real simplicity of being the best buster in the world is to be as helpful as possible and to go fast. A lot of people underestimate how fast they need to go. Um, you know, you maybe it's your first job and you think you're doing the job, you're going around, you're, you know, resetting some tables you're helping with the water and you know picking a few plates up off the off the table as well but <clears throat> if you go fast really fast you know don't go so fast that you're scaring guests away and stuff like that but if you move as fast as you can and get really efficient at doing all of these different things you're gonna be able to be more and more helpful and you'll actually make more money as a busser um, if you're able to perfect that. If you um, make it to where a, a server comes by their table and they go, oh wow, that's already done. Or, you know, whether it's resetting it or, you know, may I take this plate for you when someone's finished and you pick it up. The more helpful you are and the faster you get things done and more efficient, the more servers are gonna go, wow, man, I made a lot of money tonight. My tables were turned really fast. You know, I probably made an extra 30, 40 bucks and they're gonna, they're gonna give you extra on top of the normal tip outs that go to a busser. Now, why is this a good transition to becoming a waiter? Well, it's probably pretty obvious at this point, but if you're making a great impression on all the other waiters at the restaurant, waitresses, and they're like, man, they are so good at this and they're talking to the guests they're they're pulling plates um, they're oh can I get you another coke you know they're already doing all these little pieces of what a waiter a good waiter would be doing and they're just a busser like I didn't expect them to do all this and to be this helpful and to, to work so hard and efficient and be fast so the managers are definitely gonna notice the servers are definitely gonna notice and they're gonna want you to be a part of their team and they're gonna recognize you as a peer you know the most common thing that happens whenever you get younger people in particular that come in to be a busser is they kind of they walk real slow they do whatever was in the job description just the bare minimum and you know servers just sit there and go yeah they're gonna they'll stay a busser for a while you know they're never gonna be a server. They might have come in and applied to be a server and the management said no. You, you need to start as a busser. If you want to try that, you can work here. Uh, but if you want to if you want to transition up to that, or if you just want to make really good money being a busser and have fun, the faster you go, the more fun you're going to have anyway. Instead of feeling, uh, I'm at work, blah, blah, blah. You just go fast and you get a lot of stuff done. The time's going to fly by. You're going to make more money. They're going to tip you out better. And, uh, Time will fly by and you'll be done and you'll be ready to go home and it'll be more fun that way. So that's the simplicity of how to be the best busser in the world, being helpful, going fast. And if I was to add anything to that, it'd be communication, you know, always asking, hey, do you need help with something? Is there anything I can do to help your table? Or just asking the table, hey, everything goes good. And you know, if they tell you something that you're not really allowed to take care of, you know, grabbing drinks from the bar or, or running food, then Okay, thanks. I'll let your server know when you go talk to him. So anyway, that's pretty much it for this one. See you next time.